This is by Denise Jolly, and it's called I Love Dick. I love dick. When, it press, when it's pressed into my lips, balls resting gently on my chin. This is what I call poetry. I love early morning rising dick. Mid-afternoon silicone or skin. Want to take it all in. Your ass looks so sweet. I have to rock you right fucking now, dick. I love a dick that can flick a clit while it's work working it. That's right. I love me some dick. I'll admit it. I love big dick. The kind of dick that forces small body women into a fetal position. That's the dick for me. <laughs> Especially when it's curved just so for that G-spot popping gonna tell my cervix hello type of dick. I love a dick when, at first, it don't succeed, and it goes and it picks itself up and tries again. <laughs> I love a dick that should be photographed because God couldn't have made something the perfect by accident, so there has to be a record made of it. Let's face it, y'all. I love dick. But dick gets me in trouble. It leads me to love, leaves me dignitized. <laughs> My friends and I will talk for, about it for hours. We find ourselves in bars listing out names for it. I'll stick to the classics like Dick, Penis, Johnson, Junk, Prick, Chubby, Main Vein, John Thomas, Noodle, Dingle, Sausage, Member, and my all-time favorite, Cock. For me, saying the word cock comes from two places, my throat and the walls of my vagina. <laughs> it's like a mating call, an ass shake, a gust of hormone. It's me telling you, Come inside. You're welcome here. So you can see, I am sure, why Dick and I have an on-again, off-again relationship. Perhaps I should invest in the seasonal Dick ideology. I need a Dick. We hit it off. We find common ground. Learn what each other like. We spend weekend days shifting between movies, food, and each other. Soon days become weeks, we weeks become months, and BAM! That prick that cradles the Dick starts to take over. Begins to speak for the Dick. Says things like, it's getting way too serious. I think we should see other people. It's not you, it's me. What they do not realize is, it's not about them. It's about me and the dick. <laughs> but how can I explain that in a way that they'll understand without hurting their feelings? I cannot. So I acquiesce, acquiesce. I accept defeat and move on to the next season. But y'all, I found an alternative, a solution. The holy grail to the dick dilemma. It's so thanks to the makers of Copper Top, Duracell AA Battery, and the Rabbit Pearl for that oh no, 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 it's all about me type of dick because more often than not, I'm better off playing alone. That's Denise Jolly. <laughs> I think she's great. She's a lesbian.